Hi guys, welcome. Dominic Solanke, one player of the month for December, which means he gets an FC24 card. He's coming in at 86 rated squad, which is about 75k. And yeah, we're going to be completing this card, taking it into foot champs for five games and continuing the champs run. But yeah, onto some of his face card stats. He's 88 rated with 88 pace, 90 shooting, 89 dribbling and 92 physical. So he looks real solid for the price. And yeah, here he is with that power header plus. He's 6'2", high medium, with 3-star skills and 4-star weak foot. He can only play striker and centre forward. On to some of his in-game stats, he has 95 sprint speed. He has 92 attack positioning, finishing and shot power. He has 92 vision with 93 short passing. 90 reactions, 91 composure and 91 dribbling as well. He has 99 head and accuracy with 95 jumping. He also has 99 stamina and 92 strength. And then onto his playstyles, he has the power shot, flare, acrobatic, aerial, and then most importantly, the power header plus. And hopefully we can score some headers with this card. And then yeah, onto the team, we're going to be using a Euro 2024 winners team. And goalkeeper, we've got Pickford. At right back, we've got Trent. Centre back is John Stones and Harry Maguire. At left back, we've got Tamori. CDM is uh, Declan Rice. The two centre mids partner in him is Phillips and Bellingham. At the right wing we've got Saka, and at left wing we've got Grealish, and then a striker, we've got the main man, which is Solanke. So yeah, that's the team, I'm going to be playing 4-3-3-5 for tonight in game, and then yeah, let's get into the gameplay. So yeah, I finished with three wins in five games with this team, which brings my record up to seven and three. But yeah, on to my review of this Dominic Solanke player of the month. He scored 10 goals in five games, which is two goals per game. You do the math. But yeah, on to how he feels in game. But yeah, on to how he feels in game. He's rapid. He feels so much faster than other cards. And with his dribbling, he doesn't feel too heavy either, which is really nice. And I would say that's the strongest part of this card. But on to his finishing. I thought it was going to be similar to Road to the Knockout Kane where you just shoot and it's an auto goal. But it took me a while to get used to this card, to score with him. But once you get him in the right areas in and around the box, his finishing becomes a lethal. And yeah, I managed to score a header with this card. And it feels nice having that presence in from corners as well. So yeah, my overall thoughts on this card, it's very decent. For 75k, I think he's well worth the coins or the fodder. 
and yeah if i was to rate him out of 10 i'd give him an 8 or possibly even a 9 and yeah let me know if you did this svc and also what did you think of him and that's gonna wrap up the video thanks for watching like comment subscribe and all that good stuff and yeah that's me i'm out